The current time is 7.02 p.m. Central Standard Time. And now the forecast for your local area. Wind chill warning in effect until noon Tuesday. Rest of the afternoon, very cold, partly sunny. Temperatures 14 below to 16 below zero. West wind 10 to 15 miles an hour. Wind chills to 40 below zero. Tonight, very cold, partly cloudy. Nearly steady temperature around 17 below. West wind 10 to 20 miles an hour. Wind chills to 45 below zero. Tuesday, cold, partly cloudy. High zero to five below. West wind 10 to 20 miles an hour. Wind chills to 45 below zero. Tuesday night, partly cloudy. Lows around 10 below zero. West wind 5 to 10 miles an hour. Wind chills to 25 below zero. Wednesday and Wednesday night, mostly clear. Highs 5 to 10 above zero. Lows around 10 below zero. West wind 5 to 10 miles an hour. Thursday, partly cloudy. Highs in the upper teens. Thursday night, not as cold. Mostly cloudy. Lows 10 to 15. Friday, not as cold. Mostly cloudy with a 30% chance of light snow. Highs in the lower 30s. Friday night, not as cold. Cloudy with a 40% chance of light snow. Lows in the middle 20s. Saturday, mostly cloudy. Highs in the lower 30s. Saturday night, partly cloudy. Lows around 20. Sunday, partly sunny. Highs in the middle 30s. Sunday night, mostly cloudy with a 30% chance of light snow. Lows in the middle 20s. Monday, partly sunny. Highs around 30. Here are the 6 p.m. observations. At Green Bay, it was mostly cloudy. The temperature was minus 16 degrees. The dew point was minus 27, bringing the relative humidity to 57%. The wind was west at 15 miles an hour, producing a wind chill of minus 40. And the barometric pressure was at 30.08 inches and rising. Across the Fox Valley, it was partly cloudy at Appleton, with a temperature of minus 17. At Boshkosh, the temperature was minus 14, and it was clear. In Door County at Sturgeon Bay, it was minus 15 degrees. North of Green Bay at Oconto, the temperature was at minus 15. And at the Manitowoc County Airport, it was minus 15 degrees, and it was cloudy. Now, here are some conditions around the rest of Wisconsin. Across the state, skies ranged from clear to partly cloudy. It was minus 15 at Sheboygan, minus 21 at Rhinelander, minus 15 at Chagno, and minus 19 at Wausau. Eau Claire reported minus 15, Milwaukee reported minus 11, and Madison reported minus 12. In Upper Michigan, it was clear, and temperatures were between minus 17 and minus 15 degrees. In Minnesota, at Minneapolis, snow was falling, with a temperature of minus 14. It was partly cloudy, with a temperature of minus 17 at Duluth, and minus 21 at International Falls. Here are some marine observations along the lake shore, compiled at 6 p.m. At the Sheboygan Breakwater Light, winds were west at 14 knots, gusting to 21. The air temperature was minus 12. At Kiwani, winds were west at 16 knots, gusting to 22. The air temperature was minus 15. At the North Port Pier at Death Door, winds were west at 10 knots, gusting to 21. The air temperature was minus 10. Now some observations along the bay. At Menominee, Michigan, winds were southwest at 11 knots, gusting to 15. The air temperature was minus 13. At Fairport, Michigan, winds were west at 24 knots, gusting to 27. The air temperature was minus 6. Here is a nearshore marine forecast for the following. Lake Michigan from Rock Island Passage to Sheboygan. Small craft advisory in effect through Tuesday morning. Tonight, west wind to 30 knots. Waves 2 to 4 feet. Partly cloudy. Tuesday, west wind to 30 knots. Waves 2 to 4 feet. Mostly sunny. Tuesday night, west wind 10 to 20 knots. Waves 1 to 3 feet. Partly cloudy. Wednesday, west wind 10 to 15 knots. Waves 2 feet or less. Mostly sunny. Wave forecast of ice-free areas. The nearshore marine forecast for the Bay of Green Bay will be suspended due to ice coverage. Forecasts will resume on or before April 1, 2014. Here is a weather bulletin for the following counties in Wisconsin. Brown, Calumet, Door, Florence, Forest, Kewanee, Langlade, Lincoln, Manitowoc, Marathon, Menominee, Northern Marinette, Northern Oconto, Oneta, Delta Gamey, Portage, Chagno, Southern Marinette, Southern Oconto, Vilas, Wapaka, Washara, Winnebago and Wood. Wind chill warning remains in effect until noon Tuesday. Bitter cold air will remain entrenched across the area through Tuesday. The combination of cold and wind will result in dangerous conditions for anyone venturing
staying outdoors. Wind chills across the region will range from 35 below to 55 below zero through Tuesday morning. The exception may be in parts of far northeast Wisconsin and along the lake shore, where wind chills will only be around 30 below zero this afternoon. Wind chills this low can result in frostbite on exposed skin in 5 to 10 minutes. A wind chill warning means that very cold air and winds will generate dangerous conditions. This can result in frostbite and could lead to hypothermia or death if precautions are not taken. Do not venture outdoors without proper protective clothing. If you must go outside, wear multiple layers of loose-fitting clothing. Be sure to wear a hat. Mittens provide more protection to the hands than gloves. And now the forecast for the open waters of Lake Michigan. Sheboygan, Wisconsin to Bentwater, Michigan. North heavy freezing spray warning in effect through Tuesday afternoon. Tonight, west winds to 30 knots. Heavy freezing spray. Scattered snow showers. Waves 7 to 10 feet occasionally to 13 feet. Tuesday, west winds to 30 knots. Heavy freezing spray. Scattered snow showers. Waves 6 to 9 feet occasionally to 11 feet. Tuesday night, west winds 15 to 25 knots. Chance of snow showers. Areas of freezing spray. Waves 4 to 7 feet occasionally to 9 feet. Wednesday, west winds 15 to 25 knots. Chance of snow showers. Areas of freezing spray. Waves 4 to 7 feet occasionally to 9 feet. The current time is 7.09 p.m. Central Standard Time.